Hello and welcome back to our Toon Kings playthrough. <coughs> Eye of the Vortex campaign and Warhammer 2. We are playing as the Toon Kings. Uh, we have some decent income. We've got one, two, I think four armies, which is good. However, our main army needs to be built. Also, we're going to adjust... The effects and the speech ever so slightly all right and we're working on crushing the followers of Nagash and the Dune Kingdoms and then we're gonna head out and snag as many income good as many <coughs> books as we can. We only need to grab three left, but the issue is going to be these armies. Okay, him I can take. I get the feeling he's mostly useless units. What do you got? You're definitely useless units. I should have someone... Ah, there he is. I have someone off exploring the world. Barrels of rum. Because we like money in the treasury all right he's dealing with that so we might be able to snake the pools of despair out from under him max that out what have you got this is actually probably a little too much anti-infantry um, and I now have Tomb Guards with Halberds and a ton of Tomb Guards. So. Wow. Alright, let's... And these only take a turn, so here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna boot out some Skeletons. Gonna stick in two of these, one, two, three, four of these. Why? Oh, no, no, these, 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 these do not take priority. Um, also, we can give him some archers. Four. Start building this army slightly better as well. A couple of these. Um, and everyone else is out to. So this is this is going to be a very powerful army. Huh? <clears throat> what can I get for heroes? Let's see, heroes. What do I got? I am maxed out on all my heroes. Oh well. Although we can change that, right? Yeah, we can get a Necrotect and a Priest. So let's grab the Necrotect first. And then Vulture Mountain. Let's build some growth. I only lost two units. Uh, but we are either way it's gonna take two all right let's do let's boot you we need some anti-large one two and a tomb guard oh and there we go uh, that's a pretty decent army. I'm probably going to trade up the Stalkers. Oh, they're anti-large as well. Uh, yeah, okay, that works. <clears throat> 
Alright, what can I build in Kemri? Alright, we're doing fine there. That takes 15,000 gold. I do not know if we will actually ever get to that. But we're saving up to get to level 5. It's at all possible. So that's fine right where it is. We'll be rebuilding Xandri. We're good there. Alright. Numis. Money, money, money. No. Gates. Nothing new there. Nothing new there. Ah. We do have... Wait. Events. Minus eight. Three turns remaining. Oh, we should be fine. Alright, we have a random prince. He was off exploring the world. Let's... He can assault garrisons, right? Yes, he can. So let's have him assault garrisons. Uh, I'm not gonna have him train. A bombed elixir might help. And that will end that turn. Forward. Let me just make sure the camera settings. Aha! Fastest, 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 fastest. Alright, we're good to go. You're dead. Yeah, you'd better run. Oh! Right, new Necrotech. So we're filling out this with constructs. So we're gonna recruit a Necrotect. Let's see, strong, aggressive, Sphinx Carver. Ooh, fun. And again, we've got the income. So let's snag another priest. Building up Xandri. Let's get that growth going. Alright, one more turn and then he can move out. Kill. Yeah. I still don't know what critical successes do. They should give bonus experience. Oh, we need more jars. So, all the jars in the world. And one more turn and we can take Eye of the Panther. Alright. Um... I'm gonna wait. Can we... Like, maybe to here? So we can see. A little more. There we go. And then raid. Because it's going to take all our armies to smash this black tower. Oh, and we can build things. So what can we build for weapons? Uh, bonus versus large. Weapons. Enables poison attacks. That could be useful. The plus two, not so much. for a hundred. Oh, I'm missing salt. Where do I get salt? In the salt plains, of course. Alright, well, we'll try to get that growth as high as we can, as quick as we can. I'll give us two sources, two sources of salt. In the meantime, well, even at oh, 102. So, if you're new to the channel, and you're hopping in mid-playthrough, we use jars for pretty much everything. So, this is our bottleneck. Money is our bottleneck as well. But, unlike the other factions, we don't have to pay for upkeep or hiring people. So, it's not as bad. Alright. Ooh. 
Oh! They're coming to me! Hero capacity plus one. If they're coming to me, I may go after them. What do they have? Let's see. Flagellants. Battle Pilgrims. Magical Aura. Handgunners. Luminarchs. Royal Hippogriffs. So this is not a small army. They're being seized. He's gonna be a while. But then he can move out and snipe this. Hold on. Why can't I see? Interesting. Let's go. Stop that. Thank you. Let's go. Check that out when we get a chance. I don't know why the fast forward doesn't stick, but I really wish it would. Oh! Interesting. Well, I can't do that. But we did get a free priest. So the good news is I don't have any foreign armies in their territory. Let's raid! Should give us there we go another priest knowledgeable or proficient I'd rather have the reserves oh here we go aggressive let's do master of ceremony all right and back to I think we're doing the third dynasty yeah so wisdom of the third dynasty I don't know. If I take this, will the Sam Storm end? Let us find out. In the meantime... The lich priests have me wary. All right. Jars are maxed out. The snow... The steed might be worth it. What's Tomb Strike? Melee attack, weapon damage, every 90 seconds can cause terror. Hmm. Our hit points. Um, let's do Tomb Strike. And let's see what happens when we take this city. Alright, so we're going to quick save. Uh, we do have the means to beat it down. And I don't want to take attrition. One, two, three, four. I have more ranged units. So we're just going to fight this.
All right. So we have two ways in. Uh, nope, 16's fine. So we're just kind of smashing this door right here. Let's get a basic setup. So here's my door smasher. I think that's the only one. So we're going to have to be kind of careful with it. Oh, no, wait. Cetra the Imperishable is a door smasher as well because he is on a Sphinx. Armored piercing, armored spellcaster, anti-infantry. He's only got one spell, but it's a hell of a spell. So we're not going to do any of this. So let's start the battle. Immediately pause so we can get our ranged units assigned to ranged targets. Right. I don't see a hero on the walls. He appears to be in the back and damaged. Now this is where it gets tricky. These are shielded, so shields. Ah, no shields. These are Unshielded Tomb Guards, huh? Alright. Oh, but they regenerate. Well, that's just nasty. Ow. Alright. Um, we'll get these guys to climb the walls. So... No. There we go. Wait, these guys can bust in walls? Weakness to fire causes fear. Death blow, constant self. That's interesting. All right. So you go up there. A necrotect can fight. So we'll put you on this side. And you on this side. We'll put you guys here. We'll put you guys here. Range to set put you guys here. We'll put you on that. Set. I think everyone is assigned to something. And you're here. And you're here. Alright. Let's do this. So the shielded guys are going to build up the walls. We're going to keep an eye out on him. Make sure he stays in our sphere of influence. Because if he goes out, he'll start taking extra damage. Oh, that's fine. We took a couple of hits. That's okay. Yeah, go beat down that door, would ya? Can you beat down this door? No. I, I'd like you to... I don't know why they do this. You're in range to fire. Fire! We want the tomb guard to be the first up the wall. No spells. No damage spells. Alright, hold on. What do we got? Causes terror, soul blight, or spirit reach. None of these are AoEs, huh? Alright. Although, we can hex an area. A rather large area. Are we in?
Alright, I think... That is... Everything. Oh, they're getting kills faster than we are? Well... What can our prince do? Tube strike! And our Necrotech has no abilities to cast. So let's go back. Oh yeah, we're uh... Doing that. My god, the range in these guys. Here, let's move these guys up so they can help. Alright, get them in there. Go Halberd to go. Move him up. Get the halberds in there. Alright, we got this. Alright, you three go kill. How are we doing? What do we got left? Aspect of Dread. Why not? How's our prince doing? Our prince is doing just fine. All right, we got this. Go help clean up. That was easy. Oh no! Our Ushtabi fighter dudes. Archers. Uh, I guess these guys would be good against Ushtabi. Do they count as large? No, they're constructs. I don't think there's anything that gets a bonus versus constructs. Get out of there! Maybe they survived? Nope. Unit wiped out. Alright. 